It's a motivation. <laughs> you gonna stand behind me? Are you on the screen? No. Stand like right near me. <laughs> Come on, <Ray>, go! <laughs> Come on, go! Right here for uh, today I did the first ever um, Ironman virtual race. Um, it basically over Friday, Saturday, Sunday, a specified time you need to complete a 5k run um, and the pro section was the 90k bike which was on Facebook watch this morning and then I also need to complete a um, 21k run so you could do all of the, these things whenever you like within that time frame but I um, obviously had to do the uh, the bike from 9 a.m. this morning and uh yeah so got off to a really good start um i was racing it wasn't really a race uh, per se um not really any prize money just a couple of premiums up for grabs for the for the pro, four pro women uh, it was myself Jeannie seymour jocelyn mccauley and um angela nath were the four girls um racing today four ladies racing today and yeah we got off to a good start um at nine uh the Girls went pretty quick from the gun, so I was kind of hanging in there um, around the, the other two girls that were at the front, Jocelyn and um, and Angela. The Jeannie was uh, a little behind. I think she was kind of taking the race as it kind of was intended as just a participation exhibition, so she was kind of cruising along back there. And around 45K in, Tim were kind of having a bit of fun and my lovely husband Tim came in uh, with a couple of my Iron Man trophies as motivation I guess um, and like was kind of holding them up in the air and kind of cheering for me and then he I said I'll go around the back so like that people could see um, at home what I'm dealing with in my house and so he uh, walked around the back of the trainer and I guess he kicked the cord at the back of the trainer, which unplugged me and uh, basically disconnected me from the Ruby platform. You want to plug your thing in and unplug it? All right, sounds good. Yeah. Where's the... Uh, where's, the where's the tech support? I need tech support. Yeah. Right. And so I didn't realize what had happened at first, obviously. Just saw that my um, wattage and everything went to zero and I wasn't racing anymore. Would you like me to make you a mimosa? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, well. We brought your motivation in here for you. Maybe it was you. I cursed you. No, you pulled it out. Oh, I hit the cord. No, I think, I think oh. it was Tim. <laughs> And so we sort of tried to hustle to get him back in to figure out how to troubleshoot and, and get it working again. But I guess once you disconnect connect from the platform, it's kind of game over. So from then, I think that was around 45, between 45 and 50 kilometers into the race. So still um, sort of halfway in, still a fair amount of racing to go. Um, so after that, I just, you know, kept riding not as hard as, I, hard as I was, but at a pretty decent um, wattage because you know I wanted to complete the challenge, and so I just pedaled through till um, all of the girls finished um, riding, and yeah, that was basically it. And um, hopped off, and I did my 5k run right after the bike just to to get that nailed. So my bike portion and run portion have been completed, and tomorrow morning I'll do the 21k half marathon. And yeah, that's about it. Pretty exciting morning around here at the Carfrey O'Donnell house. <laughs> Tim's trying to redeem himself by making me milkshakes and eggs and it's working. <laughs>